And sometimes I wonder what I'm going to do because there ain't no cure for the quarantine blues. Anyway, you guys, eat Mary Pat here. Hope you're doing good. Important to forget it, me. So like many of you all, I got the freaking quarantine blues because I'm stuck inside my house. And uh, right now I lock myself in my bathroom, as you can see from the beautiful pink towel. And uh, I'm just sitting here thinking about life. Because all I do these days is go to work at the Acme, you know, try to dodge people as best I can, and then come home uh, to my house where uh, all I do to stay busy is do laundry and clean my house and uh, smoke my smokes and drink my Cokes and can't leave my backyard, go back inside, do dishes, cook food, eat the food, cook more food. Uh, drink a white claw every now and again and maybe a box of wine and sit and who knows. But by the fifth time I clean my house and one day I realize my house will never be clean because it's full of the assholes I can't stand the most. And I got to make conversations with them like, hey Larry, do you see Tiger King on Netflix? What a hit. <laughs> Don't find that Carol Baskin's a bitch, you know what I mean? And, uh, you can only have the same conversation so many times before you want to jump out of your third floor window and I don't even have a third floor in my house. And uh, all the people out there who are struggling, who are thinking, oh, I can't get through it, I can't get through it. Listen to me. Listen to your Aunt Mary Pat. If I can live with my asshole daughter Kelly and my husband Larry and I can be stuck in the house with them for the majority of my time, yous can make it too, okay? It's tough right now, and we're all sad, and we're, you know, people are struggling. And uh, I just say, find something that you love. In my case, it's Cabernet Savignan. Lock yourself in a private room in your house, one uh, large enough to stretch your legs. I chose my downstairs bathroom. As you can see, decorated for Easter, which ain't going to happen no more. Got my vibes up there. And uh, try to take care of yourself and pep yourself up. Because hopefully this will end soon and we can go down ashore and party, party, party. And, uh, you know, maybe I can have my nosy neighbor Maria over. And she and I could uh, make nice just in time for Memorial Day. So... The moral of the story is here, kids. I know things are looking dark and dim right now, but there's a bright future ahead. Just uh, stay safe, stay indoors. Grab a white claw. Love you guys. Take care. Bye-bye.